How can you ensure that you're going to have a long-term career in the music industry? Well, obviously, there's no guarantees to anything in life, right? But from my experience, what I found and from the people that I know that have maintained a career um, you know, for at least five, ten years in the music business, uh, one key component drives and connects all of them. And that one component or that one aspect that I find in, in my personality and their personalities is the ability to serve people who can pay you for your music. Now, it sounds very simple and maybe oversimplistic, but think about it. Most artists um, believe that they have a talent and that they are special and that their sound is amazing and that their you know lyrics are awesome and their melodies are incredible. And so because they feel that they have this talent, that the world owes them success, people should download their music, people should just give them, you know, hand them their money, basically. Um, this is not a uh, helpful mindset to be able to be uh, successful in the long run, because in any business you're in, you want to be a real estate agent, you want to be a carpenter, you want to be a plumber, you want to be a teacher, whatever it is you want to do, at the end of the day, you have to serve the needs of customers. That's the only way that you're going to be successful. Um, you can see how when businesses and companies don't serve the needs of their customers, their customers either boycott, they'll leave, they'll go to their competitors, they'll find another way to get what they want. So it's no different in the music business. So if you're not serving somebody and servicing their needs, and those people are people that have money to pay you, then you're not going to be successful in the music business. And to ensure that you're going to have a long-term career, you have to consist consistently serve those needs and those people, those companies, parties, whoever they are that can pay you. Uh, the TV, film, music licensing business has a lot of companies and a lot of money uh, out there for music producers and musicians like myself and like you watching this video. So there's a need there. There's a marketplace there. And I've been able to uh, maintain my career for almost 10 years now just because I'm consistently servicing the needs of somebody with money that can pay me for it. So that's really the secret to long-term success. Um, now, much easier said than done. Uh, getting into the TV film licensing world you know, might be exciting in the beginning and maybe you sort of you know, get a couple of contracts and you get some placements and you think you know, the world's opening up for you. And then maybe you have a slow couple of months and you feel like, eh, I, I thought I was going to be you know, a multimillionaire in a year and it doesn't happen as fast as you want, so you sort of get distracted or go somewhere else. Well, that is exactly why most musicians do not persist in the TV film world. It's not that they're not talented. I have seen amazing producers, producers that should have gold and platinum records under their belt just for the fact that they have amazing songs, amazing um, production skills. But they just don't have persistence. That's really it. They just didn't have that pure human will to just keep showing up and keep delivering great music. And, you know, even if you have a slow month or a slow quarter or whatever it is, they didn't see the long term goal of like, hey, in, in life, you will have slow moments, you'll have great moments, you'll have ups and downs. But that's just part of the journey. So um, persistently showing up, that's really the name of the game for having a long term career in the music business and specifically in the TV film music licensing business. If you want to learn more about the TV film music licensing business, then click this video right here and you'll be sent a free crash course which will teach you everything you need to know to get started today.